Some health occupations is a hands-on, real-life experience type class, which is what a lot of employers and even colleges are kind of looking for, some kind of an experience um, in the real world. Um, it's also very um, thorough in anatomy, medical terminology, and then just some basic fundamentals. You learn how to take blood pressure, pulse, temperature, things like that. First semester, we spend our time learning about different health careers, and we have an anatomy and physiology class. In second semester, we get to go out on rotations and visit different healthcare professionals and see different careers and everything. I actually just got to go to Sheltered Workshop the other day and met some really amazing people there. I absolutely loved it. You take an idea uh, or a project from the outside and you work with your hands and you put it together whether it be print or digital. It, it helps you uh, turn like a thought or an idea into you know a set design something that you can actually work with you can put it on anything really it's, it's a lot of fun it gives you the base you need to to go on and be a graphic designer you go on to a lot of different occupations through taking this class it, it sets you up very well for it The Early Childhood Program helps students get hands-on training working with children. I feel like I'm making a difference in children's lives. The first semester it's all about learning the books and learning the rules of like what to do in these sort of situations and that goes towards your college hours so that's all college credit and then the second semester you're mostly with the kids. If you're thinking about going into an education field that helps you kind of learn the ropes of what your college courses are going to kind of be like and then also you get the one-on-one -on -one with the kids. I encourage students to join FFA because it's one of the largest student organizations in the country. It's a leadership organization that is based on agriculture. We're teaching the kids about agriculture and preparing them for agricultural careers. I think that's a unique experience that these kids get to have if they join FFA. We love FFA! It's hard, but at the end of the day, you're like, DECA, DECA. <laughs> I love DECA. DECA is a lot more than just a marketing or a business class. It taught me a lot about life skills and communication skills. You still keep learning a lot about marketing and business and just communication skills too. I think it's really fun. It's a lot more challenging, but I think that's what makes it exciting. DECA is a great class. Marketing is a great class to do because it really improves your communication skills. You get a lot of travel opportunities and we get to see how great you grow from the beginning of the semester to the end of the year because your confidence and your presentation skills just really increase. You know, I came to the DECA program, I was really a rugged kid, you know, I was getting in a lot of trouble. DECA really gave me a family support, the support I needed to further myself as a person. It's everything from entry level to somebody that feels like they're, you know, well experienced in cars. We can make them better than what they were. We do everything from restoration to collision repair to graphics. It all entails rust repair, framework, suspension. Occasionally we'll pull an engine transmission out, you know, and paint the engine compartment and put it back in. So pretty much anything that involves a vehicle. We have Quite a few of our students already get interns, so they're working before they're even done taking this class. They have jobs in the community in the area. It's definitely helped me. The instructors have given me a lot of tips and helped me be a better technician, and I feel very confident going into college next year. Uh, we fix things that are broke. We make things that don't exist, you know, uh, so it's kind of a hands-on but you also use your head, so it's kind of a combination of both. They can gain a lifelong career. If they like machining, being a machinist, there's a lot of opportunities in the area. Uh, you know, they get out in industry, get a career, make, make a real good uh, livelihood, and they enjoy what they do. I would suggest anybody take this class, like girl, guy, even if you're not looking to go in like to the automotive industry, like 
it's just good to know about your vehicle and know like if something were wrong that you could take care of it and you don't have to rely on someone else. We'll cover anything automotive related. So that might be motorcycles, backhoes, skid steers, trucks, buses, who knows. But it's basically to give a basic foundation of automotive technology. So that if somebody wanted to get a job in the repair industry, they're, they're ready to go and have a good basis to work off of. I want to be an aviation mechanic in the Air Force. So this has helped me with like my test scores, like going into like the military and everything that I need. It's boosted it and just helped me tremendously. And through different months, we learn different uh, types of welds. It's a really fun class. It's different. Once you get out there, you can make a lot of money and it's a really good career to get into. This career, I can go anywhere and do anything. So it's very versatile and I really like that. This is a building construction class and we cover uh, plumbing, electricity, uh, survey and layout, do all the carpenter stuff, framing, trim, shingles, concrete, drywall, cabinets. I'm going to go into the construction field after high school, so I think I've learned a lot from this class. So right now there's a huge demand for uh, construction workers. I can put as many to work as I, you know, can come across.